Hi, I'm Whitney Lauritsen from EcoVeganGal.com and I'm hanging out with Citizens for Health here at the ADA Expo in Los Angeles. We're going to talk with some people about the mislabeling of high fructose corn syrup in food and beverage products. We've got a great petition here that we want them to check out and sign, so let's go find some interesting people to talk with. I just wanted to know from both of your perspectives, what sweeteners would you avoid? And you know, any perspective on things like high fructose corn syrup and other sweeteners out there? I like to use honey whenever I can. Agave nectar is another something that I like to use. The fresher the better, to me, with anything. I'm here with Chef Che Gravy, which is an amazing name for a chef. I love that. Tell us a little bit about what you do. But what, what I do is I, I go around to a lot of farmers markets. I go around the local farms. I, 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 get, I try to get the freshest ingredients I can possibly find, and I cook with them. So what brings you here to an, a diabetes event? Well, diabetes runs in my family. Um, I've Ever since a child, I've been dealing with family members who, who, who've had diabetes. Um, and since I've become a chef, um, I, I just took, took on the role of, of making, it, uh, making the awareness known that, you know, what you eat is, is what you are. Well, that's a wrap for the ADA Expo. I learned a lot of information about how food ingredients play a role in preventing and reversing diabetes. If you want to learn more about ingredients such as high fructose corn syrup, you can visit citizens.org slash HFCS. I'll see you next time, and thanks so much for watching.